but he loves you. Yeah. What's up, little guy? So these little screaming hairy armadillo pups were actually born at Audubon Zoo. Um, they're just a few months old, even though they are larger. Um, when they were born, they were extremely tiny, no hair, um, very soft, and over the past few months have um, gone on to eating solid foods, running around, they're burrowing, um, interacting. They're just an awesome addition to our facility. So these guys are one of three species of hairy armadillos. They are the smallest. Um, and they also roll up into a little ball. And you'll also hear that they do scream, but that's only if they're threatened. It's an awesome building and amazing, amazing critters. Do you guys remember? And what's really unique to this species is, like in comparison to our prehensile tail porcupines or the owl monkeys or any other species that we manage, we're really involved in the care with mom. For example, we're getting weights on the babies, we're tra tracking lactation, we're checking mom. With this species in particular, it's completely hands-off. Um, once they're born, you do a, a first check and then you leave them completely alone. They will go in and then burrow underneath it. Um, they also burrow for food as well. Um, so great. Anytime you talk about poop, you know, we'll, like, we'll get like it is, it is. Right? Yes, it's pretty special. We have a really unique situation where we have owl monkeys, we have prehensile tail porcupines, as well as Linnaeus tuso sloth, as well as armadillos all in the same area. So they all do interact, they all form relationships. So it's a pretty spectacular uh, exhibit to visit. Jelajahi cara baru mendapatkan informasi. Download Metro TV Extend sekarang.